the reason that black people are in the streets has to do with the lives they're forced to lead in this country. And they're forced to lead these lives by the indifference and the um, apathy and a certain kind of ignorance, a very willful ignorance on the part of their co-citizens. Everybody knows, no matter what they do not know, that they wouldn't like to be a black man in this country. They know that, and they shut their minds against the rest of it, all the implications of being a black father, or a black woman, or a black son. And all of the implications involved in a human being's endeavor to take care of his wife, to take care of his children, to raise his children to be men and women in the teeth of a structure which is built to deny that I can be a human being or that my child can be. The great question in the country has been all the years that I've been living here and I was born here 43 years ago, is what does a Negro want? And this question masks a terrible knowledge. I want exactly what you want. And you know what you want. I want to be left alone. I don't want any of the things that people accuse Negroes of wanting. And I don't hate you. I simply want to be able to raise my children in peace and arrive at my own maturity in my own way in peace. I don't want to be defined by you. I think that you and I might learn a great deal from each other. If you can overcome the curtain of my color, the curtain of my color is what you use to avoid facing the facts of our common history, the facts of American life. It is easy to call me a Negro or a nigger or a promising black man, but in fact, I'm a man like you. I want to live like you. This country is mine too. I paid as much for it as you. White means that you are European still. And black means that I'm African. And we both know, we've both been here too long. You can't go back to Ireland or Poland or England, and I can't go back to Africa. And we will live here together, or we'll die here together. And it's not I am telling you, time is telling you. You will listen or you will perish.